My name is Jeffrey Payne. I served about 24 years, six months on a life sentence that I was pretty sure uh, I was gonna be serving for the rest of my life. I was recently released. I made parole about four months ago and I've been out, not that I'm counting, but about three months and nine days. Freedom is not anything that I ever saw me enjoying in my life. I, I always knew that from the age of 17 that I would die in prison. So to go in front of a parole board that has always told me no and generally tells everyone no and receive a yes um, was very surprising for me. This is a story about second chances, opportunities, redemption, transformation, and those who believe we all can live better because of it. We are truly giving them skill sets for them to take back to the outside world to actually become a productive citizen in the community that they go. It's happening inside the walls of Allendale Correctional Institution in rural Fairfax, South Carolina. Most of the some 1,200 men who live inside this level two facility are convicted of violent crimes and serving lengthy sentences. Some know this is where they will die. Shortly after opening in 1989 as a level three facility, meaning maximum security, this place quickly earned a reputation of being the worst of the worst. Shots have been fired, the inmates still refusing to comply. They have mounted themselves with mattresses from the units, sticks, mop rings, rangers. The reputation for Allendale when we first opened up is if you want to know how to get to Allendale, just follow the blue lights and sirens and look for the smoke. That's how bad it was in, in the early 90s when we opened up. Um, we had our share of disturbances, assaults, escapes. Um, we had our share of, of just turmoil for a short period of time. Every day you came to work, you, you came to work with the mindset of actually going in, fighting every day, every day. And when it was time for you to go home, you went home with that mentality of go get you some rest, gear up, and get ready to do it the next day. But in 2011, the administration had a change of heart about the way it was operated. And ever since, Allendale Correctional has stood out in a totally different way. Right now, it's a lot of different because you got opportunities. And if you want to better yourself or you want to be a better person, this is the place. This is Character in Custody.